Hey everybody, how you doing? Joe here from LTD Premier Properties. We have a brand new product that we just closed on yesterday. It's called 367 High Street. It's a complete remodel interior and exterior. Uh, it's a fantastic unit. We're gonna do really well on this. Gonna try to crank it out as fast as we can. Stand by here and I'll take, a, I'll take uh, stand by here. I'll show you through the properties. You can see what we're gonna do. Uh, so check it out, okay, here we go. All right, so I'm gonna take you to do a, a walk through here of the property. Like I said, we just uh, got this one yesterday. So it's very, very fresh and very, very new. Uh, so uh, I've got the kids out here with me. We're doing a little uh, uh, a little swapping of some materials here and there, but, uh, but they're hanging out with us. So we'll check it out here. Let me take you through. So here it is. All right, right as you come in through off the, <coughs> off the road here, see they got the uh, porta potty here, already got here on station. Detached two car garage. <coughs> And with the metal roof, metal roof uh, throughout, whole lot of bushes right here at the front, uh, which are all gonna have to come down because when I get the picture here, when you see it eventually, you know, we actually wanna see the front door from right here. So it looks, I mean, right now it's just totally covered, um, but, uh, but you know, we're gonna get, take care of this, get rid of all this foliage. Here, coming in, this is a, a deck that needs to be pretty much uh, removed uh this awning is also going to get removed we're going to have to move the gutters there's a bunch of wasps there we'll have to watch out for that when the demo starts here very soon but let me show you inside what we're looking at I got locked out here. all right so <clears throat> open entryway here to straight through you can see the view there that is uh west facing here in freeland uh looking west towards the uh, olympics over there very beautiful you got shipping lanes that come through looks really really nice um, first door on the left is a giant uh, bedroom <coughs> um, with a uh, with the window there that goes out uh, bay window uh, looks really nice and uh, carpet which is all going to get replaced here with the new uh, pergo flooring uh, so we're going to have that flooring uh, throughout. There's a hallway here. Where we're going to, we'll talk about that when I come through. We're going to do a lot over there. And then a big space here in the living room, which we're going to uh, rejuvenate. And then this is the kitchen, which hasn't been updated, I don't think, in a very, very long time. <laughs> so all of this is going to start coming out on Monday. This is all going to get demoed. We're getting brand new cabinets, brand new appliances, new sinks, all the chrome finishes. It's going to look really, really, really nice. <clears throat> so, yeah, this, uh, you know, what? their sink doesn't even match up with their window. We were trying to figure out if we can get the sink to match up. It's going to be really hard, you know, because this corner is just super tight. We were looking at that quite a bit when we were doing the cabinet design. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, they got a smaller fridge in here right now we're going to put a regular size regular size fridge in here and then we're actually going to do some work here on the wall we're going to frame out this wall to bring in some space here the fridge is going to come all the way to the end here on the end and then we're, these cabinets are just going to move back a little bit so <clears throat> yeah anyway there's the uh there's the general showing up here on the site he's the boss Ad Admiral, 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 Admiral contractor. You don't. Contractor. I thought you were army, so you want general contractor. A uh, couple of things here that you notice. Um, well, this this door um, opens the wrong way. <laughs> it's a it's a right hand swing, and I think we're going to change it to be a left hand left hand swing because it just totally blocks these uh, these stairs. Um, but that light works, and then there's a sign here. There's a, couple of weird, really weird things. This little ivy that's growing, that ivy has got to come down because it is such a pain. Anyway, and then the uh, watch your head here. Um, so we're going to have to fix this because it is right there. I mean, you can see me. See, like, yeah, it, this, so all this is going to get adjusted. Uh, so we actually have the head clearance that we want. So that's going to get fixed, and that's going to affect what's going on uh, down down this hallway. <clears throat> All right, down the hallway, if I can figure out where the lights for it are. Oh, there we go. All right. So, 
they've got uh, so it's actually two units so there's its own separate unit with a kitchen and bath and laundry room upstairs and we're going to do the same thing downstairs uh, but i don't really like the location here um, we don't really like the location so it's going to get moved here the washer and dryer is going to get moved to over here which is just a massive closet that is lighted you can see it it's just a ton of closet space <clears throat> so we're going to basically going to put the washer and dryer right here washer and dryer here there's going to be cabinets there cabinets there cabinets above cabinets above and then shelves over the top so, we'll, so we're doing some plumbing moving here and then this is going to turn into floor to ceiling uh cabinet space so uh, this little is going to be a laundry area um, here and then cabinet space there this is what's going to happen here is the upstairs bath slash master bath i don't know if you could say it's a true master because you can't access it from that master bedroom which is weird so we're actually going to create space here we're going to add a door so you actually have a true master you can access <coughs> this bathroom from the master and then that tub is coming out it's old everything's getting re retiled completely um you know the entire bathroom is going to be totally remodeled <clears throat> and then this is the master bedroom you know again there's going to be a door right there a lot of electrical that we have to move but you know we'll take care of that and then two closets and then again you get a view also from your master which is pretty which is really nice really nice okay and then this car carpet's coming out because, again, it's going to be that resilient flooring throughout. All right, let's go take a look downstairs. So, like I said, it's a separate unit. So, you could have it all as one big house or you could just lock it up. Well, you can lock this door and then you'd have your separate unit. And then you could have, like, Airbnb kind of deal. And I'll show you a little bit how that works. So, anyway, downstairs unit. Here we are. I got kids here. Oh yeah, there they are. All right. Get outside, goofballs. Are you okay? <laughs> Did Sam smash right through? Yeah, yeah. Ay, ay, ay. All right, so uh, downstairs here, just a nice big living space. You know, looks uh, looks nice. Uh, lots of room. This is the kitchenette downstairs. We've got a lot we have to do in this kitchen downstairs. We, uh, this electrical panel is getting moved completely, uh, not far really, but uh, because it's so close to the water here, we have to get it moved. So it's actually going to go on the outside of the, of the uh, house, which is no problem. And then that sub panel is going to get tied up into that one. And so it's all going to be connected together. But this all new cabinets here and what we're doing is they have like this dungeon room back here. <laughs> this seems like a dungeon room, just this really weird looking space so we weren't really sure what to do with it so we came up with an idea and you see they have these cabinets here but it's just straight back to the foundation wall there's just nothing there they're just pretty basic so i think what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to take out these two walls and we're going to make the kitchen a lot bigger so it's still going to be like um you know like this galley style so we're still going to have a fridge there and then more cabinets here but we're not going to have a wall between between this kitchen and that space. And then this wall is going to come out and then um, and we're going to move the stove a little bit and then more cabinets here. So the kitchen will be a lot bigger here. But it uh, but this little portion is getting removed. And so what you'll see is, you know, you know, cabinets here longer, though, and then cabinets there longer and then the space beyond it is going to be like a dining room is what we're going to turn it into and so we'll put some lights up in the ceiling there and we'll put a nice dining room table kind of stage it as like oh you could have a private sort of dining room whatever you know i suppose some power outlets so people could put their tv on the back wall if they wanted to sit and watch tv if they wanted to be uh, away from the windows for whatever reason maybe we'll put a heater back there too as well so <clears throat> so that's kind of the thought for this space and then we have to do a little bit of reframing here for the closet to make all of that flow through and then they kept it open underneath the stairs i don't know why so we're going to frame that off and then make this like a real closet it's not going to be the bifold doors anymore it's going to be uh real real actual doors so uh it's got all this paneling here this uh 
paneling that's coming off, we're going to put actual drywall in. For this unit down here, we're going to put a, this in this bathroom, the stacker washer and dryer. So a stacker. It's already got the drain of the plumbing for it, so it's going to be super simple. Just throw that in there. The heater is going to stay, but I think we're going to move the location of it a little bit. Dryer vent's going to move. <coughs> Excuse me. Dryer vent's going to move. <coughs> Double sinks, dual sinks here. Oh, and dual sinks upstairs, which I didn't mention, but that's happening too. And then the same design throughout the whole house. So the tile is going to be here with the new tub and the, and the, uh, uh, the trim, the accent. I'm thinking we're going to go accent straight down like that, as opposed to across the whole space. I, I like that for some reason. We'll see. And then there's a water heater that's getting replaced in there. And that's pretty much about it. <clears throat> and then this other room over here, you know, again, we're going to drywall it. We're going to go ahead and... Um, they did this, made this closet like super big and there's just a bunch of wasted space back here. I mean, I don't think people are really gonna use that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna demo it out. We're gonna frame it out and put an in-wall cabinet right there, um, right in that space. And then we'll frame out this closet so it's actually you know, a little bit more constrained. So it'll be a little bit smaller, but we're gonna create more space back here that's functional that you can access uh, from here by having to crawl all the way in there. <clears throat> and then the dryer vent, uh, instead of being down there, it's going to come up to the ceiling uh, and be in a box that's going to go out there with that wall. But uh, downstairs also here, we're going to be replacing every single window, all of them. This slider also, we're going to get one with a lock on it, you know, slider with a lock so that they can make sure that people can get in from outside. They can walk down here and they can get into their own separate unit. Um, is how we're going to do that too. A <clears throat> little bit of septic work needs to be done. Not too much. Um, we've got the guys coming to do the septic work on Wednesday. And I'm still trying to figure out what we're going to do about the landscaping. But we have a bit of stuff here. We already came in on Friday to get rid of this tree. Because we have to get a dumpster in here on Monday. And I want to put the dumpster right here. So guys can throw stuff away from the top. And then from the bottom. Oh, and there's also a hot tub out there on that deck. All right, everybody, that's pretty much the that's pretty much it. That's the end of uh, of the tour here at the start. I'm going to take pictures and stuff. I was supposed to bring the camera today. I forgot that. I'm going to have to do that tomorrow morning, or maybe I can just take pictures of this phone here. But uh, LTD Premier Properties, we got another project uh, online here. We'd be on. This one's going to be a beauty. It's going to be done fast, fast, fast. You're going to be amazed to see how fast this is going to go. All right, so uh, give us a call. You know, if you uh, if you got a problem, you need some help, and you need an investor to give us. Uh, to get a look at your project, go ahead and give me a call and uh, be happy to take a look. All right, see ya.